The accusation surfaced nearly a decade ago. Now, tonight, a former Valley priest indicted for allegedly sexually abusing two boys. His name, well known, Father Jack Spaulding. ABC 15's Mike Pelton in the newsroom gathering details. And Mike, a lot to digest here. Yeah, Katie, the indictment has seven counts, and the claims go back to the early 2000s when he was a priest at churches in Phoenix and Mesa. Father Jack Spaulding, previously accused of sexual misconduct, now facing actual legal trouble. When the innocence of a child is taken from them it is an absolutely unspeakable act. And this indictment sends a clear message that those who commit these heinous acts will be held accountable. The alleged victims, boys who would have been under the age of 15, the time frame 2003 to 2007, when Father Spaulding was a priest at St. Gabriel's in Phoenix and St. Timothy's in Mesa. I would say it's justice uh, long overdue. Tim Lennon is with the Survivors Network of those abused by priests, known as SNAP. He's referring to previous allegations against Spaulding. In 2011, the diocese suspended him after finding allegations of sexual misconduct with a minor credible. Spaulding ultimately resigned and according to the Diocese of Phoenix was removed from ministry and prohibited from publicly identifying himself as a priest. At that time, it was really just as for this week's indictment, the diocese says they were made aware of an allegation last summer and they've cooperated with the police investigation. The vast majority of victims of sexual abuse is that they don't come forward at all. So when someone does uh, it demonstrates a great amount of uh, bravery on the part of the of the victim. Father Jack, who is now 74 years old, is very well known around the valley. We've been trying to reach him tonight for comment, but no response so far. We're live in the newsroom tonight. Mike Pelton, ABC 15, Arizona.